Today is Sunday, April 12th, 2020. I'm here at Seal Station, which is uh, one of the new rapid transit stations here in Winnipeg on the Southwest Transit Way. Today is the first day of operation for the new Blue Line. That's our new rapid transit line. It's a completely new service model for Winnipeg. It's huge. I'm just here waiting for the first bus. It's going to come around that bend, the Beaumont Bend or whatever they want to call it. Uh, but we're here at Seal Station. I was thinking long and hard about whether or not I wanted to be on the first bus that was leaving Balmoral Station, but because of everything that's going on in the world, I figured it might just be safe not to and stay back a distance, um, and that's what I'm doing. I'm going to practice social distancing by staying off the bus, but watching it go by, I still wanted to witness the first Blue Line bus, uh, and I'm going to hang out here for a little while and just see what other buses come by. We might see a few feeder buses. Uh, as the sun rises here, it's currently 5.59 in the morning, which means that it's about 10 minutes away from the first bus being here at Seal Station. It's going to be exciting. This is the day that transit changes in Winnipeg. Um, I hope that maybe when things do calm down a little bit and social distancing measures are being pulled back, that maybe uh, transit enthusiasts can go and ride the first Blue Line bus outside of the coronavirus. Maybe that's something that could be arranged. But for now, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to stand by, wave, cheer it on, uh, and celebrate a new era of transit here in Winnipeg. The new stations actually have a really nice feel, and I'm actually hearing, as I stand underneath, that the acoustics are actually pretty good too because of that curve over top. But they feel a lot brighter than the older stations. Uh, this station in particular, like every other rapid transit station, has the heated shelter. Uh, it has a little decorative siding on the pillars alongside. You might notice the electronic sign up above that, tell, that tells you when the next bus is coming. That will replace the old LED light signs. Lots of clear signage and information screen right beside me. Uh, Seal Station itself has several hundred parking spots that you can come park for free and ride the bus. I think I'm the first uh, customer to use it, even though I'm not riding a bus. I am right now the only car parked here in this lot. Uh, but it's still, you know, it's exciting. There's between Seal and I think Clarence is the other station with the park and ride. I think there's over a thousand park and ride spots where you could come park for free and use transit uh, to get to the U of M or go downtown. That's very useful. I'm going to be using that a lot. Uh, but there's also lots of feeder routes that are shown on the screen beside me as well. Um, but this is Seal Station. This is the look of the new rapid transit stations. Uh, let's go back to waiting for the first bus, which is apparently four minutes away. So that was just the first ever Blue Line bus that just went up over the McGilvery overpass. Uh, it came through Seal Station. It was bus 398, which I think is the last of that order that came in. Uh, you might have noticed some of the blue uh, decals on the side of it. It's some of the nice stickers that they put on the Blue Line buses. Uh, we'll stick around for a bit longer, see what else comes this way.
actually turned into quite a nice morning here. The sun is rising. It seems to be a mostly clear blue sky uh, here over Seal Station on day one of the Blue Line. It's just a little bit cold. Uh, and I'm starting to feel <laughs> just a little bit standing around basically in a field watching buses. So I'm going to wait. Uh, we saw the first two southbound buses and uh, 60 that was deadheading it looks like. But I think now what we're going to do is we're going to move over to the northbound platform and watch the first northbound bus go by in just a little bit. Well, that's about all that I've got for Blue Line opening day. Uh, a transit supervisor came by to chat with me to see what I'm up to. Uh, very nice man. And we both took pictures of the first northbound bus that you just saw. My camera, my actual camera, uh, does not like the cold and kind of died out on me. So I'm on my phone now. Um, but yeah, that's Blue Line, day one of operation. It's here uh, when these social distancing measures do kind of calm down, then it's here for you to use. It'll still exist and uh, it'll definitely be a very useful addition to our transit system. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Go ride blue when it's safe, but for now, stay home, stay safe, um, and happy Easter, I guess.